Hey Bills Fanatics, welcome back to another Madden video. And this time we're just going to be playing a, a random game. But first, let's take a look at the Bills roster. So, in quarterback group, we have AJ McCarron and Nate Peterman. I'd say maybe in camp, AJ might take that job. But if we do draft a quarterback, that'll be a good competition. AJ McCarron has three years of experience, Nate Peterman would have one. And then the rookie, obviously not in the NFL yet, so be a nice competition to see how that goes. In the running back group, we have LaShawn McCoy, Chris Ivory, Taiwan Jones, and Traveris Cadet, who are all signed on the roster right now. And fullback, we have Patrick DeMarco. Wide receivers, we have Calvin Benjamin, Jordan Matthews, I ha still have him on the roster, Andre Holmes, Zay Jones, Brandon Tate, Dupree, I cannot even pronounce that name. Bray and Brandon Riley. A uh, tight end group, we have Charles Clay, Nick O'Leary, Logan Thomas, and Kari Lee, and Keith Tolbridge. The left tackle group, we have Deion Dawkins, and Madden threw these guys in there as well. Uh, Richie Incognito at left guard. At center, we have Russell Bowden and Ryan Groy. Right guard, Vladimir Dukas and John Miller. Right tackle, Jordan Mills. Marshall Newhouse and Connor McDermott. Left end, we have Trent Murphy, Shaq Lawson, Eddie Yarborough, and Cap Cappy. At right end, we have Jerry Hughes and Marcavis Lewis. <coughs> At defensive tackle, we have Kyle Williams, Star Lutuleli, Adolphus Washington, Cedric Thornton, and this random guy that Madden threw in there. At left outside linebacker, we have Lorenzo Alexander and Dion Lacey. At middle linebacker, we have Matt Milano, Julian Stanford, and Xavier Woodson Lester, who I believe Madden also threw in there. At right outside linebacker, we have Raymond Humber and Tanner Vallejo. At cornerback, we have Trey White, and you're going to notice I have two Vontae Davises here, because Madden, as you can see, well, not here, but in the game, it wouldn't let me put him in for some reason, because on the right here, it shows a little medical sign. That means that he's on injured reserve, and there is no way possible to take him off. So, I did the next best thing possible, and create him in Madden. Uh, Leonard Johnson and Lafayette Pitts. Then we have free safety, we have Micah Hyde, Cole Anderson, and Raphael Bush. At strong safety, we have Jordan Poyer and Dean Marlowe. At kicker, we have Steven Hauschka. Punter is Colton Schmidt. And that would be it. Now, if we go over to the death chart, here's a quick run through. I'm not going to say the names as this took a long time already. So this is how the wide receiver group would look without Jordan Matthews in there. Uh, pretty simple. I did put Trent Murphy at left end because in a previous video I was told that he would be better at left end. And at punt returning, I do have Micah Hyde, because I don't have Brandon Tate in this. Alright, so it looks like when I picked random, we are going to play the Saints. So let's see how the Droy and Droy Rider Up will do. Trey White versus Marshawn Lattimore. Let's get in it.
I'm Larry Ridley, and this is the NFL on EA Sports. As we head towards kickoff, two quarterbacks will be on the field today trying to push... And here's the two quarterbacks. We got Drew Brees, longtime Saint, excellent quarterback, and A.J. McCarron. Just looking to step in here and do something this year for the Bills. All right, now while we do kick off here, I'll write down in the comments what you guys think the Bills should add, whether it be wide receiver... Uh, quarterback that we might need or any other position now starting out here is AJ McCarron he is wearing the number 10 which is his college jersey uniform we're gonna run McCoy to the left here looks like a nice hole is open and a nice hole is open and he almost got through that nice 15 yard rush on first down all right let's push another run Let's do two runs and uh, maybe a pass if we don't go any farther here, which we do. It's a nice, another, looks like 13-yard run, 12-yard run. And here's the Bills starting offensive line. And here's the wide receiver group, tight end, and running backs. Pretty solid in my opinion. I had Calvin Benjamin open, but Say Jones somehow caught that. And here's a starting Saints defense. It's a pretty good defensive line. Here's the linebackers. And here's the safeties, which really did a really good job this year. Defensive backs, including Marshawn Lattimore. I'm going to put Nick O'Leary on a hot route. He's going to go in and across the field in case I need someone to go over there. But I'm hoping Charles Clay will be open. Oh, see, Nick O'Leary almost got that. Oh, fumble, fumble. Oh, no, who's got it? And the Saints look like they have it. That was a hit stick on McCoy. And first play on defense, the defense held into a two-yard gain. And that's another run. Uh, three yards. It is third and five. And they got a first down on that play. Nice pass over the middle by Drew Brees. So how do you guys think the Bills defense would do this year? I think that I know the secondary they're gonna be on point going after the the balls in the air they're gonna be forcing those fumbles they're gonna be doing anything possible that was a nice spin move by Ingram there I'm gonna try a little blitz oh I don't know who is covering him And Drew Brees is fitting these balls in there nicely. It's hard to cover against the Saints. Especially with a quarterback like Drew Brees. And he just throws it out again. Two plays in a row. He threw it out. That was nice coverage. So it looks like they will just be kicking at the field goal. But they are punting it at the 38-yard line. That is a surprise. Micah Hyde is back, deep to return. Oh, it's a fake! I would have never guessed. I, 
Wow. I really don't know what to say to that. I've never seen Madden do that to me. Oh, man. Oh, that better not be a face mask. Okay. Oh, it is a face mask. Adolphus Washington, you can't grab for the face. Oh, wow. He snuck right in between those guys. And first touchdown goes to the New Orleans Saints. Now we got Kelvin Benjamin going out. Hopefully, we can keep it that way. I'm going to sneak it in there. And nice catch by Calvin Benjamin. Let's take a quick timeout. Oh, I'm looking for Nick O'Leary on this play. Oh, Nick O'Leary's got that. And out of bounds at the 10-yard line. Looks like we're going to tie this game up. And I don't even know where he was throwing. I was actually throwing to Andre Holmes, who was cutting like short over the middle. I was not throwing to Charles Clay, who that ball went to. But AJ McCarron tearing over. I don't know what to expect from that. Hopefully that does not happen a lot this year. We really don't need turnovers. I know Tyrod is good with keeping the keeping the ball. I was not throwing the turnovers. All right, so during commercial break here, if you guys want to check out my channel, it'll be up on the screen. It is Yo Mama Jr. So go check it out. All right, let's see if the Saints can get downfield. Gonna hopefully stop them. I'm playing outside because I don't want them to catch a ball outside. And wow, that was a nice catch. Trey White almost had that interception too. And it is a sack. The Bills put up a sack. Kyle Williams in the backfield. And the clock is still running. So it looks like they're going to take a timeout with a few seconds left and just kick the field goal. Oh, almost a block. Lafley at Pitts almost got in there. And here's a halftime stats right here. The Bills lead in rushing and average yards per play, but takeaways and passing yards and score are one of the most important. Man, that guy can put some spin moves on me. I think the Bills need to up their linebacking core a little bit more. Like Tanner Vallejo, Matt Milano. Sure, they're good like backup guys, but starters. I think Milano is the closest to a starting linebacker. Except for that play where I totally missed. And the Bills stopped him at the one yard line. I thought he was going in there with his fourth and goal. I'm really skeptical now. I'm kind of worried about a fake. Hopefully we do not fake this one. I'm actually... <laughs> Quite worried about them faking it, which they do not, but they do make the field goal to make it 13 to 0. So that means the Bills are down by two scores. Did you see that one handed grab by Zay Jones? That's what we need him on this roster. Even though he got in a little trouble in our last couple days, we need him on this roster. He's. He's an excellent receiver. He's going to have a breakout sophomore year. Look at that catch. One-handed. Odell Beckham right there. What do you think about that deal? Odell Beckham on the Bills. Zay Jones, another nice catch. And we're moving the ball down the field. A little bit of hurry up offense here. AJ McCarron is going to run the ball. And it is a first down. We got to hurry up and get this in. We got to really have to get this in this play, which it looks like to the right. It is open. And McCoy, free, easy touchdown. Bills have to stop them here. It better not be a pass. 
And it is a run. And do they have it? Do they have it? It is fourth and inches. Are they going to fake it again? That is the question. Let's see Zay Jones. Zay Jones. Zay Jones. Zay Jones. Man, another Odell Beckhamish catch. I'm doing terrible at clock management right now, but I have confidence. You always have to have confidence. Especially when you got Zay Jones. And he got out of bounds. That's why he has Zay Jones. Oh, terrible pass. McCarron. A little bit more outside, Zay Jones would have had that. I should probably just throw it up to Calvin Benjamin. But uh, I'm not in the end zone yet. That was a nice pick. I got to admit that. And he steps out of bounds. Wow. I got to see the interception one more time. Calvin Benjamin, that, come on. I throw it to you for a reason. You're supposed to win those battles. You got to help your quarterback out. He's a young quarterback only here for four years. You just got to help him out. Yeah, that's Marsh. Oh, that's pass interference. That's human pass interference. You saw Lattimore jump up and hit Benjamin and prevent him from catching that. Which is the end of the fourth quarter, and the score is 13 7. McCarron had two interceptions. One was definitely his fault, which was the opening drive. He overthrew that big time. Now, I know Madden, the last couple times I played with AJ McCarron, he hasn't been like, accurate. But he does have an arm. He can't throw it long. Um, but the last interception, that was on Calvin Benjamin. And it was actually pass interference. Uh, Marshawn Lattimore did hit Calvin Benjamin out of the way. But Calvin Benjamin really didn't go up for it. Which he should have. But if you guys did like this video, make sure you like, subscribe, and share this video. You can also comment down below what you would like to see next in the Madden series. Um, I can add players. I can't create players like I did with Vontae Davis. Um, so, I'll, like a draft quarterback, if you want me to put in there, a draft running back. Like anybody, basically. Um, basically, I'm just going to be sticking with how the real life bills are going right now. So, this is obviously, I went over the roster earlier. So, that's how it'll look. Um, if anybody wants to obviously play, I'll put my name up on the screen right now on my PlayStation Network account. So make sure they give a PlayStation or else it won't be possible. But if you guys enjoy this video, make sure you like it. And I'll see you later.